personal finance. Life Gains is always trying to help you guys make gains in all the areas of your life. Fitness, finance, technology is the backbone of this channel. And we're gonna talk about living paycheck to paycheck and how you can come off living paycheck to paycheck. Rebecca, how, how are you managing not to live paycheck to paycheck and afford security detail, afford a driver, afford them high dollar glasses you wear, and not live paycheck to paycheck. Tell me how you're able to do all that. Because I am rich, very rich, bitch. Oh, <laughs> she, she rich like she rich I'm like Rick kidding. James. Right. <laughs> so, if you're not as rich as she is, we've got a couple of steps you can take to ensure that you're not living a paycheck to paycheck. Number one is set goals. Um, you've got to figure out what's important to you in life, and you've got to figure out a way to set goals to get to there. And number two is create a budget. You've got to understand how much money is coming in. Budget smudge it. How much is going out. That is not just layman's terms for someone writing a business plan. You have got to have a budget for your house. Number three, and this is where a lot of people fail. You need to track every dime you spend. Do you? Yeah, that's where a lot of people fail. Do you track every dime you spend? No. You don't? I don't. Oh, well, you rich, so it don't work for you. Right. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> and no, no, really. I do actually try to track everything that I spend. I think my 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 spending habits they kind of have ebbs and flows. Some days I do well, not days, but you know, some months I do very well with my spending. I'm tracking, I'm budgeting, and then other days it's like it's all just shot to hell. Well, if y'all could really be sitting here, she smells and looks like somebody's month worth of paycheck. I don't know what Ooh. high dollar fragrance she's wearing and these name brand glasses and the, and the footwear. Oh, oh. oh, God almighty. <laughs> that must be some new off that they just released because that stuff smells pretty good. <laughs> Number four on our list is pay off debt. Um, guys, don't fall into the consumer trap of being in debt to everybody in America. That is the number one way people seem to get sidetracked in life with their financial goals is because they owe everybody money. You've got to find a way to get that debt paid. And last but not least, the foundation of all this is figure out ways every day to save money. Oh, that reminds me. I did have a life gains last weekend. After your last story about the guy going to the thrift store, mm -hmm. I took your advice. I went to the thrift store, got me a life gains. What happened? I found some money in a purse there. Oh, see, damn it. Up That's top. What I'm, up top. Life That's gains. what I'm talking about. See, y'all. Listen to the life games we give y'all. We would not steer you wrong. Won't steer you wrong. So those are going to be our personal finance tips for you this week. You want to set goals, create a budget, track everything you spend, pay off your debt, and find ways to save money on a day-to-day -day basis. And this can get you to a point where you're not living paycheck to paycheck. Guys, that's going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> this life game session is over. Bonito. Don't forget to like that video. Like the video. Comment and subscribe. Comment and subscribe. Go get yourself a life game. Oh, go get yourself a life game. And we'll see you on the next video. Catch you on the next video.